over the last few months, guys, there have been two TV shows that we haven't had a chance to watch. They stopped and they left us with nothing for, I think it was eight weeks. And today, well, today for Britain, yesterday for America, they're back. You've probably guessed what they are. Supernatural and Vampire Diaries, both of which I love. Supernatural I love because there is just too much epic, basically. I love the funny, I love the hot, I love the oh my god this is actually quite scary even though it's just a TV show. I love the, <laughs> I love the quotability of it. Just the, the endless quotes. Seriously, it's not food anymore, Dean. It's Darwinism. Dude, you fugly. Two of my favourite personal quotes. Um, The new episode, for instance. Pudding! Oh my god. Too good for words. I had to pause to laugh. I'm not even joking. Vampire Diaries I love because of the similarities to Twilight and because of the fact that I think it's a really good story and I like the way they're doing it. I tried to read the books and I could never really get into them. I don't know why. I guess I just felt like there was something missing. Just didn't feel... <laughs> I didn't feel as drawn to them as I felt to Twilight books. And I don't know, but with my with me, when I'm reading a book, I have to feel like I love it straight away to be able to keep watching it. Otherwise, I just get bored and I'm just like, no. Um... And I kind of started watching the show because everybody was like, oh my god, you have to see it, it's so good. So I watched it and I was like, oh my god, you have to see it, it's so good. Like, I was surprised that I enjoyed it because I really didn't think I would. But I did, I loved it. It was amazing show. Tally, that was for you. Mwah. Also, Katie, amazing cake. This is what happens when you have a birthday party and you all get drunk and say stupid things. Uh-huh. Let's not delve any deeper into that subject, shall we? Um, so yeah, I'm really excited that both of these shows are back. I'm really excited to be 23. I'm really excited to see what this year brings. A certain Mr. Bewley tweeted that his goal for this year was to surprise himself, and I've managed to surprise myself about five times already. Which is probably quite pathetic, really, when you really think about it. But I have, and I plan on continuing to surprise myself. And that was my phone going off. Yeah. Um... I don't know, I guess this year could be some amazing things. Unfortunately, I've just been made redundant from my job, but I'll get another one. It's cool. I've been there before and well, I haven't made redundant before, but I've been jobless before, just never without any notice. It was literally kind of go to work redundancy. But anyway, um, I'll find another job somehow. Anybody that wants to hire me, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good at jobs. I like jobs. Money, please. Yes, thank you. Um, I have so much that I want to happen this year. And I guess I'm just excited to see how it turns out. Yes, that's right. So, much love. You guys rock. And just do me a favour. Surprise yourselves. <laughs>